Yo, what is up you guys? My name is Benji and welcome back to another video. Before we get started with this one, make sure to please drop a like in the video for some good luck for AMC. We do have earnings after the close date, so, so drop a like in the video for some good luck. I'm super excited to announce that we currently have a few more slots open for our exclusive private trading discord. Inside the discord, you'll find real-time stock picks from yours truly, see all my trades in real time, and chat with other thousands of investors that are constantly posting plays, trades, and more. We even have multiple millionaire investors in there, which you could pick their brain, ask them questions, etc. So make sure you guys join before we close the server again, because we are only letting in a limited amount of people. Click the second link down below in my description to join. All right, guys, we're almost through the trading day now, about two hours left, and AMC is still looking pretty good. Up around 3% as of this moment, but overall still trading with moderate to low volume. It looks like on the volume side of things, we probably will close out somewhere near where we were on Friday. But who knows, maybe close to the end of the day, we could see some big pops because we do have earnings coming up. So we might see some late minute buyers hop on. As far as the buy to sell ratio today, though, AMC is looking pretty good once again. 6,219 buy orders versus 3,691 sell orders. AMC is number three as far as top orders by Fidelity customers. Moderna and Tesla are above AMC, but, but overall AMC is still holding quite strong near or at the top of the list. Next up guys, let's go through a few tweets here. AMC retirement funds are loading up on AMC. This is an extremely positive signal since they are normally very conservative in their investment approach. But looking at AMC's potential, they cannot resist missing the opportunity of one of the greatest wealth creation events. And this is quite true, guys. Go on fintel.io, type in AMC, and take a look for yourself. There's different retirement funds actually buying like thousands or tens of thousands of shares of AMC. Looking back, I probably wouldn't have even guessed that retirement funds would necessarily be blown up on AMC. But I do think that they see the potential as far as the earnings, the reopening, the theaters are doing absolutely great. On top of that, the short squeeze is looming ahead of us. It's going to happen at some point here. And worst case scenario, AMC could be used as a nice hedge against the rest of the market. If AMC does cause some sort of spiral for the rest of the market, it'd be nice to have some shares in your portfolio. And next, guys, looking at the number of shareholder votes, it seems that AMC has been shorted at 1000%. Since now we are getting reliable sources of information on the average amount of shares, this is referring to the say technologies, the integration, be the integration between the shareholders' portfolios and the say technologies app. Right here, guys, we see 63,500 votes. That's 63,500 individuals. Let's just say 63,500 of us. Out of those people, there's 67.7 million shares accounted for already. That means that each one of these people have over a thousand shares apiece. Which is bringing us to a conclusion that there are definitely synthetic shares out there. This is what we've been speculating on for months now. I mean, this has been talked about for so, so long. But now we have concrete evidence. Hopefully the SEC looks into this. Hopefully Gary Gensler looks into these numbers. And we can get down to the bottom of this. Next, guys, the short interest report for AMC as of today. Just as I suspected, last week AMC was being shorted more once again. Short interest is currently at 16.27%, utilization 94.51%, and shares on loan 10618 million. This is increases across the board. Once again, guys, it'll be crazy to see how some of these hedge funds that are holding on to these short positions react when they see the earnings report come out. If it crushes, which it's supposed to, if earnings crushes like it's supposed to, these hedge funds are going to be sweating. Next up, guys, we had a huge block buy earlier today on the NASDAQ. 60,370 shares of AMC at 32.50, worth almost $2 million. Like I said, I wouldn't be surprised if some of these big buyers come out closer to the end of the day because earnings are supposed to absolutely crush, but we'll have to wait and see. But if you guys want to stay up to date with everything else going on with AMC, make sure to please subscribe to my channel with notifications turned on so you never miss out on a video. Also, drop a like in the video for some good luck for AMC moving forward here. And lastly, guys, join our private exclusive Discord server. It's the second link down below in my description. But join fast because we are only accepting a few more members. Thanks as always, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.